Hey, we have wave four of McFarlane's superpowers. They haven't made a Joker yet. That's my Joker. Um, and that's his hat right there. <laughs> anyway, so you can see the original 84 next to the, the new one. I've shown it in my previous vids, which for some reason YouTube has not decided to put over videos that just had people speculating about what the fabric of the cape may be like. Well, I got, if you, you know, subscribe to me, I showed you guys six weeks ago that this fabric was actual fabric, much like the original. They've learned their lesson. They don't use the same polyester stuff on this Wonder Woman that they use on this Wonder Woman. I mean, and another way to tell is just I mean, you can see the woven in there. It just, just really, it, it looks great. Um, it's the same material used for Tim Drake's cape, which um, is just, just comes in yellow. Um, if you want to learn how to make a black and white cape, follow me. Um, I'll show you how to make a black and white cape out of different fabrics. Uh, I used uh, just some polyester on this one, but we have a satin and um, uh, black and yellow Tim Drake cape coming. So that'll be fun. Uh, probably later on tonight. Um, we've been working on it. We just kind of had a couple of busy days. Um, notice it says these toys are four inches. Let me show you a four inch toy. All right. Just hit that pad. All right, there we go. This is a four inch toy. These are not four inch toys. They're five inch toys. So I don't know why they keep saying four inch. I thought that was incredibly bizarre. Like, why would you change your toy size with one inch? Um, but it's, it, you know, this, this Joker goes pretty well um, with this, this over here. And you can find those and oh geez, Batman, what are you doing? That's Adam Wet Adam. Mm-hmm. Sneaking a peek over there at uh, Wonder Woman. And mentioning Wonder Woman, we have her Invisible Jet, which is basically a um <laughs> just a yellow <laughs> string down there. Uh in a real system for some sort of uh, rescue and clear plastic, just clear plastic. And it sells for only $30. That's right. Rush out and buy it today. Um, let's see here. Um, okay. So <sighs> I would recommend pegging your figures. It helps them stand up straight. I mean, a lot of these only require one. This one I think might require two. It's it's a little strange. Watch this though, because his, his his leg is kind of rubbery and it goes right there. I mean, it's rubbery. It's weird. So I don't know if it's going to require. I guess it's going to require another one because it wants to keep coming out like that. So anyway, moving on. It, it looks like. The same exact size, and uh, the Tim Drake cape is a little different than the original material for for Robin's cape. Um, you know, I can I can show it to you here. I get it real quick. I kind of had it up there on another Robin figure. It's it's this fabric. Um, it's a little bit different, but it's still very high quality. It's still a fabric. But it's not, sh I mean, I don't know if you can see, well, it wants to shine off on camera, but there we go. You can see that the shine is not the same. It's not all, I don't know. It might be a better fabric, who knows. Um, but it's certainly better than the fabric used for the, uh, the old Superman and the old Batman. That was no bueno. I mean, the, the hush Batman, no problem. The, uh. The Wave 1 Superman right here with the hole in it. The infamous hole and the crappy, flappy polyester. No problem. No problem. It didn't even, uh, well, 
It almost made Wonder Woman lose her lasso because I only used one millimeter string to make it. I need to get some two millimeter string because Wonder Woman, as you may notice, does not come with a lasso. Good job. Good job. I guess it's because of insurance reasons, maybe ch children choking. I don't know, but that's all good. And we can show off the final... It's the Batmobile, and it even does this, like the uh, the old Batmobile did. Um, of course, the old Batmobile looked a little different. It looked more like a Corvette or a Camaro, Camaro mix. <laughs> Look exactly like it now, um, which is why I call the new Camaro the Batmobile. Um, <laughs> But it looks pretty neat. It's got some some jet coming at fiery stickers there. They they don't they don't light up. I, I thought they were gonna light up or something, but I don't see any uh thing that says it needs batteries. It may. I'll give it another overlook, but I didn't see it. So really that's um that's it. I, I can give you a more in-depth review later when I have a camera person here to help me out. So I, because I don't have four hands. I'm from Planet Fun Time, but we don't have four hands. All right. And um, like I say, everybody, you don't have to like everyone, but you got to try to love everyone and uh, keep those vintage toys new. All right. Keep it coming. All right. Captain, have fun. Out.